Hey mates, and welcome. Today, I got a really interesting deck for you all. I got the Cardian deck. So what's the Cardians about? I'll, I'll fast forward, because my turns are taking a long freaking ass time. Mainly what all these Cardians do is that you can special summon them uh, by tributing off just by effect, and then they all got a little effect of some sorts. Like for this one, you can reveal any number of flower cardian monsters in my hand and then shuffle them into the deck and then draw the same amount card of numbers. The card that we just got rid of actually makes it so that I can take one card flower monster from the deck except for this own card and either add it to a hand or special summon it. This way I can fill up my field really easily to get all my special synchros up. The synchros are the best deals of the cardian deck. Like right here, Cardian Lights. Our opponent cannot target uh, flower Cardian monsters we control with card effects. Also, those monsters cannot be destroyed by card effects during my opponent's draw phase. If they draw a card for their normal draw, they I inflict 1500 damage just for them drawing a card. We can also skip a draw phase the next turn or negate this card's effect for my own um drawing face so that's just for my pleasure i guess but there's a whole lot more of extra cards which one of us will see as of now we got egyptian slime god slime up this one was pretty scary 3k damage i was like ah, dang it all right so that happened still hmm i was like how am i ever gonna get rid of this shit so i just went in Got rid of the spell card because of the effect of a card. A Cardian card. Now, this is the boss monster. This boss monster is really OP. We can negate the activation of a spell and trap card. Um, and if I do so, we destroy it. If a flower Cardian monster my opponent controls, uh, that opponent monster has its effect negated. During the battle phase only, if this phase of Synchro summons a card, is destroyed by battle on the opponent's card effect while its owner controls it, you can special summon one Flower Cardian Synchro monster. Just whichever one, ignoring its summoning conditions. So if I would have two of these, I could just get this one up again. That gets really OP. Right now I can choose which cards I want to have on top and in which order I want them. Every time this card's, uh, card attacks, it negates the effects, so he was fucked up right now. Alright, so we got a decent setup, he only has 2k life points left. He tries to make his last move with the Winged Dragon of Wrath by Ancient Chant. But no, 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 that didn't happen. So we could go in for a face of the attack. He was gonna banish this card, but he forgot that we could just negate the effect, so um, I guess this was just a GG for us. Uh, let's have a quick look at like how the deck works, right? Alright, so this is the deck. Guardian Boys, I call it. Um, as you can see, a lot of Guardian cards. The only difference cards that I use are Wrecker Panda. Wrecker Panda makes it so that if I pay 500 life points, I can set the top cards of my deck to the grave. So if that's a, uh, let's say this big boy Guardian, that's a 12 star. And I get two ti 200 times of my attack and defense added because it would be a 12 star. Alright, the, also the only difference would be Drago's, uh, Drago Dia is the Empowered Warrior. This makes it so that if um, a monster is destroyed by my opponent's attack or card effect i can add one warrior or spellcaster type monster with 2k or less attack from my deck which would be all of the cardian cards so that's just really good uh, i also got one for one we got a lot of uh, level ones which are needed to start up everything coming so that's something um i start out with three times a uh, flower cardian pine three times a Pine with Crane, then we go in with Wrecker Panda, 3 times Cherry Blossom, 3 times Cherry Blossom with Curtain, we got to go with Peony if they written, Guardian Glover, 2 times Maple, Maple with Deer that is, we got 2 times Guardian uh, Willow, 2 times Willow with K 
Calligrapher. I was like, which one was it again? But it was Calligrapher. Uh, three times Palawa, because it's just a good card. And I got one times, I got Palawa with the Phoenix, um, which is just decent. In my extra deck, I got, of course, all the Guardians cards. I got number 45 added, um, just because it's a good card. If this card just fades up on the field, um, the target effects are just negated. So that's just perfect, actually. It has 2200 attack, so it's decent. And it only costs two level 2 monsters, so that's perfect for us. We got Underclock Tacker. Uh, once per turn, we can target one face up monster, discard point two, and one face up monster your opponent controls. The opponent's attack loses attack equal to the attack of the target that this monster points to. So that's just really nice. We got Boral Guardian Dragon and Boral Sword Dragon. Um, just fillers, high damage, good effects. What else is up to it, right? Um, so I hope you actually liked this video and it helped you out a little bit if you wanted to create a freaking Guardian deck, which is just amazing. I'll make sure to put down in the description um, a deck list as well. So you guys can just easily copy it if you guys want to, or even edit it if you guys want to. Um, please don't, please leave a like and subscribe if you wanna. Uh, that would be nice. And I hope to see you guys another time. See ya.